Hey everyone, Merrick's here bringing you another video. This one is actually the beta for the new stipulation tours. Um, so I'm in the beta, so these are not my actual coin or cash numbers. Uh, it's just what you get for the beta. Um, I'm not use. I didn't sign up with my main account. Uh, I just have another account so that I signed up with. Um, so this isn't my main account, so I don't have my normal roster or anything. I just have a beta roster. Um, so it looks like you load in and you have a bunch of guys uh, at three star gold, four star bronze, um, with a varying assortment to choose from. You have some um, health packs and whatnot. They do give you a beta credit card so you could purchase stuff from the store if you want. Um, looks like you can still do the road and things like that. Uh, so that's kind of neat. Uh, let's take a look at the store actually. So I don't know that these um, offers are what will be there when it's live. Also keep in mind uh, I am League uh, 10 in this one. So it looks like uh, the higher the League the more offers you unlock. So I would assume they will be different. It also looks like they refresh. So I would assume they're on a timer like uh, the Showdown is. Um, so there's at League 10, there's some uh, Tier 4 metal case you can get. And I have, um, I don't have any of these marquee coins yet. Um, you can get a 4 star gold token, 5 star silver token. I do have some of these uh, these coins. I've tried a few matches and uh, a couple matches to kind of get a feel for it before I did a video. Um, and it looks like you can buy the marquee credentials here. Um, with these coins and that lets you do the special uh the special whatever stipulation tour i guess um and get these marquee coins so taking a look at the events here and i'm going to do a couple uh videos of these this is just the first one the marquee stipulation tour uses uh special currency it's those tickets oops wrong button sorry guys it's those uh, tickets uh, that I showed you. It costs 19 to do it. And let's see. We can't go because we don't have 19. Um, and you can use enforcers and stuff to get more rewards for doing this stuff. This one looks like it'll give you up to 17, up to 51, up to 102. So you're talking about 170 marquee coins uh, from doing this uh, one time. So, kind of keep that in relation to what we saw in the store there. Um, I, I don't know how the stipulation tours are going to work for sure by the time it goes live, but right now it's kind of neat. The Gemolition one, uh, it looks like there's a rotation of things you can do. Um, the first one is free, and after you do it once, it costs money. Uh, I do have this one unlocked for free, and I don't know if it's going to cost cash when it's out of beta or not. I have no idea. Uh, those are all questions I don't know. But the first one is free. Uh, you uh, you enter. You can see the rules right here. Um, so that's your max score. It gets you 140 coins. And this tells you how you can get scores. So destroy blast gems, make blast gems, destroy regular gems, win the match, get pins, and then, of course, modified gems, destroying, make gems. So a lot of different ways to score points. Not too hard, really, to, to score the points. So you, you can uh, go into who you're going to use. And right here are the different modifiers. So if you want to use someone that destroys the specific one, you can click that and people with that move come up. The ones that make it also come up. So I'm going to try Vince on this one. And then there's this enforcer button here, which this is new. You can use guys to buff different things. So this last one gives you a chip requirement boost. Um, this middle one, you get a score boost for destroy gems. And the first one, you get a score boost for making blast gems. And it, you know, specific guys give you more points. You can select like one at a time, like so. Or you can autofill. And there you can see the boost that uh, happen when you autofill it out. So autofill seems to be the easiest for now. Um, maybe if I had my whole roster, I would try a different route. But autofill uh, works fine for now. 
So that's going to buff your scoring and that stuff. And let's see. I don't think I have any trainers set on Vince. I should probably change his moves to the, the right moves. Yeah. Hopefully I have Akum on this thing. There we go. And why not? Let's just go with that. <laughs> oh, just for funsies. Let's just put Cena on there. Okay. All right. So let's uh, get in here and do a stipulation match. Like I said, I'll probably break this down into two or three videos, um, and I'll try and do at least one match or two of every of the types. Uh, da, 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 not the best starting board roll. Oh, we do have a wild card, so, I mean, that'll work. Um, <laughs> we'll wait till we're all loaded up and do the blast gems next turn. Oh, that's nice. They spread them out for us. And you should see... Yeah, there's a bunch of points going on the board for making them. Ooh, that was loud. Turn that down. Now let's break them. Interesting, the sound isn't working quite right. Uh, it's very intermittent when it works, so... I'll let them know that in the feedback and see if that's intentional or not. You can see the points going up from destroying them. And it doesn't look like I quite maxed it. Oh, there it is. Maxed it out maybe with the win? Let's find out. Nice. So 146 chips and 20 for the first time. I believe three star means you did ma you do max it. What does this trophy mean? Ah, oh. high scores. Okay, that's cool. There's going to be a leaderboard. That's kind of neat. And then you just go to the next battle. All the same things apply, except you get more of the uh, coinage. Hopefully by the last video I do of this, I will have enough coin to buy some marquee ones and do uh, a marquee tour. So or a mar mar yeah, a marquee tour so we can see what that's all about. And I don't really know why I decided to use Akum. I should really have used Bray. I am tired this morning. That's okay. I can switch that. I can fix that. Because, uh, Vince, you're much better at using Bray to start. So, you know, good play on me there, guys. Now this, it should be much easier to max because there's a lot more loot gems out there. Yeah, the sound is definitely bugged out, so I will put that in the feedback. Boom. It's pretty interesting. I like the concept a lot. Uh, I'm very interested to see, interested to see uh, how that plays out once we're live. This one definitely looks like it's harder to max. I didn't. I don't think I maxed either of these. Yep, I didn't. But there's the boost. Okay. So the higher you get, the more you get. All right. That's interesting. If, uh, I think, it seems like it would be better not killing them one turn, so having a weaker guy. Let's switch Bray on to here.
It's pretty neat, though. I like the idea a lot, especially since uh, everyone can do one for free. It looks like that's going to stay that way. And like I said, it's it's beta, so don't know how it's going to stay. Um, so, and I don't know if you can rebuy and get the, the things again, so you could use cash to get to the rewards you want. Uh, none of that is known to actually, yeah, let's use, mm, does Goldberg do much with blasts at this level? Uh, okay, I can do this, I really can. Do, 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 do. Yeah, why not? Oh, let's use Big Sexy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm not going to bother setting his entourage. He probably won't get in the match anyway. The enforcers stay the same on tag, it looks like, so don't need to switch any of that out. This one definitely has uh, a potential to earn a lot of coins. Oh, I love it when a plan comes together. I just need to not kill him, because killing him would be bad, as we haven't made any blast gems. There we go. Oh, that sound noise is terrible. It's definitely not going to be easy to get the max amount of points unless you are taking a weaker or a more even opponent. I shouldn't say weaker necessarily, but a more even opponent so you can get multiples of those uh, bonus points out. And I had already played the normal mode on this, so um, this is the first run at the hard mode. And let's see how hard hell is. Okay. Rank 6. Score 24,000. And this is one I had reset earlier. Um, and you can see it's starred and stuff, so it looks like you have to start over from the beginning, too. And I wonder... Let's just find out real quick if you can earn those, um, earn those points again. Looks like you probably can, but I don't know. You probably just won't get the first time win bonus, I would assume. But, you know, we'll see. You know what assuming does. Makes a you know what out of you and me. Let's try and avoid pinning him. I should not have destroyed that loot gem. But you can see you need less bonus points to max on normal, too. So it's a lot easier to max. So we're going to max normal. Now let's see what we get for coins. I would assume we just don't get the uh, first time win bonus. I'm also going to be really interested to hear you guys' feedback on this um, after I post the video. Okay, so chip reward. Oh, we still get the first time too. Okay. So it looks like once you reset it, you can just play it and get the chips again. So it'll be interesting to see when it goes live, if you're allowed to like rebuy to get more of those chips to get from the store um, or not. So that's kind of interesting. But yeah, I'll be really interested. Let's uh, try Hell out. 
really interested to see um, what you guys' thoughts are. Uh, I could maybe do a live stream and we could uh, stream this while we talk about the beta. If that's something you guys are interested in, let me know. Oops. Okay. Calm down. Let's make sure... Wrong button here. Still the same rules, so we're definitely going to be weaker here. And uh, it'll be interesting to see if you need to win to get the bonus points or not. So we're going to auto-fill it. Looks like we have a nice chip boost there. And uh, let's go to work here. Definitely can win a lot more, up to 450. And it's a lot bigger score to uh, max it out. A lot bigger. Need some loot gems on this board. Come on, let's get us some loot gems. Eh. Booker definitely has got some hit points, so if we're able to not lose, we should rack up a fairly big score here. It's definitely a really cool concept. Um, if, as long as it, especially if it's not pay to win, if it's something that everyone can do and take part in, and uh, you know the store looks like it's going to be similar to Showdown Store um, with cool stuff to buy. So if that's the case, that would be cool. I don't mind if it's a low amount of cash to refresh. I just want to make sure everyone is able to play the game mode for free. Um, that's that's my main thing. So hopefully it, it stays that way. It looks like it's going to. This is a much better board for these blast gems. Might be a, a little too little too late though. Oh okay. Lots of blast gems now. Could also probably put Rusev would be the better move as well, but eh, whatever. Interesting. Oops, there we go. So it did max it. So I don't wonder if we'll... It's be interesting to see if we get the points even if we lose. Oh, we're about to find out. Maybe you get the points, but you can't go to the next match? Mm, nope, doesn't look like you get the points. I wonder if that means you failed, too. Okay. Credentials, huh? 
that would be the trophy. So I had six, and now I have four, I think. No, that's my rank is four. I don't know what the credentials are, unless it's those. No, those are chips, so... Entries use zero of four. Ah, so I did have to pay to reset it. So failing makes you lose, and then you can reset it. It looks like up to four times. So I think that's going to cover this one. Uh, we're 20 minutes in here, so I think that's enough for one video. Um, you get the point of the gem one on this one. As I recall from what I read about the beta, there's different... Um, gem stipulation tour so it won't always be blast gem so um in the gemolition i think it'll rotate through like sometimes different colors so your choose move guys and lots of different um specialty gems i think the concept's really cool because there's so many guys we don't use and it gives uh, a chance to use your roster and some of those guys that i leveled up just for tours and never play it'd be nice to have another benefit to them so i'm going to call this part one and I will try and do a video of all of the, the modes so you guys can see all of them. And hopefully before the beta ends, I can get enough marquee tickets to do the all-star tour so we can see what that's all about. So uh, let me know what you think in the comments, guys. If you want me to stream this at some point this weekend uh, before beta ends, let me know. I could stream it and uh, you guys can watch along and, and we can talk about it and that kind of stuff. So let me know what you think, guys. Uh, I hope you like this video. And uh, remember to like, subscribe, and share. And good luck out there, guys. Thanks.